I'm working today on Calliope, she's my own girl, and I want to talk a little bit about nails. Nails are, what, are the first thing you're going to come to learn when you start school, and a lot of people are intimidated because of the vein that runs up the middle of the nail. Now, there are telltale signs if you are working on a dark nail um, as to where you can cut that nail. So you have this white nail here, or clear nail, and you can see right here that the red stops about here. So you know you can cut almost to that point and be okay. But what you can do is take a little bit off at a time. And generally what you're gonna look at is the inside center and you're gonna see that blackness there. And if you just kind of whittle away at it a little at a time, Now you can see more of it, and that means you're at the end of where you can cut. Now if you look at a dark nail, and you look at it from the side, you can see where the nail is thick, and then all of a sudden, it's not. It, it starts to thin out coming towards the tip. But that's because the vein has stopped back here, like it did on our white one, and we know we can go in and we can take that much off and we're, we're okay. Now the nail is the same size all the way to the end. So just going in, you see where it's thick here and then it's not, and we just take that off. Now, if you don't have a Dremel or a file, a rotary file, but you have the splinters on the edge of the nails, what you can do is take your nail cutter and just kind of glaze over the outer edge, and that'll help take that sharpness off, but you're just kind of scraping it. You're not actually cutting. You're just scraping the edges to get those cleared away. And that's gonna leave you a nice cut nail without jagged edges. I hope that helps.